Hey party people, welcome back, Touch for Tots, you know. So, hopefully by now you've had good fun, a bit of catching, some balance, you know, exercises with the kids and we're having a good time at home, it's not too hard for you. We're gonna work on passing today. Okay, so passing now. Whilst we're learning passing, we're gonna be working on the hand catch. So last time we were working on the bread basket catch. Cool, now we're gonna be working on the hand catch. Sound good? Let's just get straight into it. Cool, so I think we're passing once again, make sure your form's nice and flat. Cool, take a bit of air out of it so it's not hard and they can grab it with their hands when they go to catch it. The first pass we're working on is just called a front pass. So I hold the ball, I bring it down, and then I just flick it straight across. And guess what, when I pass the ball, my fingers are pointing at my target. So it'll be as if I'm down here, I pass, boom, and my fingers are pointing straight at you. So get your pointers out when you pass. You should be able to see your partner's beautiful face at the end of your fingers. Here we go, let's do a couple. Front pass, pull down, hook. Beautiful, there's your face. Here we go, Tiaki. Nice, and there you go, get those hands out. Boom, front pass, and there you go. Get those pointers out, point it where the ball needs to go. Wonderful. So we go from our front pass, where the ball's down here, and we bring it up to here. What's this called, Tiaki? Um, pushing. Yeah, pushing that. Or a chest pass. We're gonna use our chest muscles now, our pushing muscles. And when I push the ball, I'm still going to be able to see hook, my beautiful partner's face at the end of my fingers, because we're pointing hook. the ball out to them. Okay, let's go. Hands out, ready to catch, buddy. Yep, there's good. And chest pass, pushing the ball. Here, Tiaki. Into my hands, push it, boom, beautiful. My turn, big push pass, shoot. Here we go, beautiful hands at the end, wonderful. Have some fun with the chest pass. Alrighty, so we've gone from a front pass down here, we flick it across, to a chest pass, and now we're gonna do a Side pass. So go over there a little bit, keep going. Cool, wait there. Nice. Now from the side pass, all I do is hold the ball in my hands, bring it down, elephant's trunk, swing my elephant's trunk, and guess what? I point my fingers when I let go of the ball. Push your elephant's trunk, shoot, and wow! It's still like There we go. And you're still pointing your pointers. Cool, we do the same thing on the other side. So elephant's trunk, elephant's trunk, and whoo, there it is, pointers. Beautiful. A bit of side passing, have some fun, make sure you do it both ways. Whoop. Alrighty, hey, so hopefully by now you've been enjoying doing the side passing. Cool, a little bit of side passing action. Now we're gonna go into one hand pass, so just using one hand. Now we're gonna use the technique of the ball just rolling out of the fingers as we pass it with one hand. Ball sideways, rolling out of the fingers, and Tiaki's still gonna do a really big hand catch for me, using his hands to catch it. You ready to do? Cool, so I've got the ball in front, two hands, I roll it into one hand and pop it across. Boom, your turn, one hand roll. Yeah, nice, now when we still pass, I still wanna see the hand pass and the fingers point. What do you reckon? Should we do it? Go, Woo. your turn. <laughs> the ball's gonna start moving, here we go. And, woo, roll it out of your fingers. Let it roll off the end of your fingers. There it is, nice spinning. And, oh, and there it is, fingers. Boom. One hand passing, and let's get that ball moving off the end of the fingertips. Cool, have fun. Alrighty, so hopefully by now you've been practicing your rolling the ball out of the hand. Okay, now what I like to do is, I like to have a little expression session. So I say to kids, show me a brand new pass I've never seen. Cool, show me something, Woo! Show me something cool. Hey! Your turn, give us a little look. What do you got, show me something I've never seen before. Oh, there you go, the old volleyball pack. Cool, what else have we got? Cool. <laughs> oh, there we go, a little wee flip behind the back. Hey ya! What else? Where's your flip behind the back? Grab your legs. Whoop! 
Oh, here we go, it's always a fun one. Ah, have some fun though. You know, take 30 seconds, an expression session. Come up with some new passes, something I've never seen before. Cool. <laughs> have some fun, see you soon. So, you know, being able to catch off the bounce is actually a hard skill for kids to learn. And then the ability to bounce pass as well. So if you've got a round ball at home, you can see we've got a soccer ball, we've got a beach ball, we've got a fun little wee knobbly ball. But now what we're trying to do is, here we go. Boom, we can do the nice and big too. Hammer them in. Cool, one hand. Cool, one hand bounce, one hand catch. But change the type of ball that we've got and practice our passing and our catching off the bounce. The other fun things we can do, we've got a bouncy ball is practicing our basketball passes. Here we go. Woo! <laughs> you get the idea, man. Let's get into our bounce passing. <laughs> Alright, so the last part obviously with catching passes, now developing small sided games or different ways we can do exercise. But I'll show you a way that we're going to put our balance with our line and our sitting into a really fun catch and pass game. Let me get a couple of balls first, I've got a couple of different ones. Yep, nice. Here we go, those two there. Oh, and the big ones, which you like. Cool, over here. Now once you're sitting here in front of me, Tiago, you're on your bum. I'm gonna go down. Cool, here. Feet it together, good fun. And I'll grab a ball. We'll start with a knobbly ball. Cool. I'm gonna go back. Let's go both back to the ground. Yep, up we come. And pass the ball. Boom. Back we go. Up we come, pass the ball, choo -hoo. Do a couple of these. That's the one working on our balancing skills. Nice, sitting up. Cool, change the ball, here we go. Bigger ball, same thing again, off we go. Hoop, pop, hoop, pop, footy, hoop, pop, yep, hoop, pop. Cool, so a really good way to have a little bit of exercise with some fun catch and pass games as well. Um, lots of different games we can play with balls at home though. Bouncing around obstacles, we can go back to our, you know, passing over the top of a chair, passing over a table, getting younger brothers and sisters involved, playing a little bit of pass, we all know the piggy in the middle games. But I think it's time to start practicing our catch and pass, and um, get stuck into it.